Dr. Nadine Caslow is the chief psychologist at Grady and a professor at Emory. And we want to talk about what the signs are. What are some of the signs, warning signs, that we should look for in teenagers that they could be a potential threat? So one of the main warning signs is that they have a history of being violent, of being aggressive. Not just sort of normal teenage violence and aggression, but something that's much more severe. And that what things do they say? Should we pay attention to that as Absolutely. Well? Any kind of threats to harm other people or to harm themselves are things we need to take very, very seriously. And very much so. How about triggers? Things that could take someone who potentially could do it to actually acting out. So those triggers are different for different people, but certainly things like trauma is a major trigger. That can be a loss. That can be feeling bullied. That could be getting expelled from school. That could be having no friends and being very socially isolated. Doctor, one, one final question. Are there things out there that are counterintuitive that, hey, we see this behavior and we might think that is something, but it's not really a warning sign? Well, I think that any behavior in and of itself is not a warning sign necessarily. Lots of behaviors are normal for kids or common in kids. It's when the behaviors go together that we need to be concerned, especially when kids don't feel supported, when kids feel isolated and traumatized. Doctor, appreciate your time tonight. Thank you very Thank much. You.